The Lord told me specifically and boldly. He told me that 2024 will be full of lack. Financial problems, food problems, uh, and all that things will be a severe matter in 2024. And this lack is not going to be in Africa alone. It's going to run out all over the world. It was scarcity. People were seriously hungry. Very, very hungry. Uh, I saw in that revelation that there are cops everywhere. When I'm talking about cops, I'm talking about every day we full of cops. <laughs> to the level that we just go in the street, we see a dead person on the ground. What is killing them? God did not show it to me, to me yet. But something is coming in 2024. I saw cops everywhere. There is, they are going to throw a bomb on one country. I don't know that country now. The Lord has not asked Rabbi Temple, but he said it's only one famous country. It might be United States of America. It might be on uh, London or England. No, London. They will not be aware that the bomb is coming. It's going to be normal, normal activities. They will be going on their way, going to their working place, going on the normal, normal thing, their normal, normal jobs. And the bomb will be thrown. Children will pass off. Men will pass off. Women will pass off. Our unbeliever will go with this. Christians will go with this. It's going to be a serious. Ah, a serious lamentation. Then as an evil spirit will release personally, the spirit is like a black smoke. The spirit is like a black smoke. This spirit will be, el be entering people's houses, spreading strange name diseases around. The Lord told me, uh, before he told me the prophecy of 2020, 2024, an angel of the Lord appeared to me. The angel of the Lord appeared to me and told me some revelation. Even warning me, he told me that, my son, do this, do this, do this. Bless you, bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My name is Apostle Peter Daniel. By the special grace of the Lord, uh, once again, I want to greet every one of us in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I pray that the grace of the Lord we continue to help us in this journey and in this race that we are going through in the name of Jesus Christ. Ah, by the special grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, today we are going to talk about prophecy for 2024. Prophecy for 2024. Before we speak about that, can we please pray? In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, everlasting Father, we want to bless your name because you are the lily of the valley. We want to appreciate you for this hour and this minute. Be glorified in Jesus' name. Our Lord, our Father, our God, we ask you, God, that you speak to us in your power, in your glorious mighty, in the name of Jesus. We ask you, Father, to touch every heart and every hearing that is hearing us right now in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. By the special grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, once again, we are going to speak on the prophecy for 2024. Uh, what the Lord spoke to me. What is about to happen? By the grace of God, there are some testimony and the uh, prophecies that I have said earlier before now. And God has made them to come to pass. And this are especially prophecy on the COVID-19 vaccines, and prophecies on the elected president of Nigeria, prophecies on the, on the new disease that is coming out, which is the COVID-19, and how people should, why people should avoid it. Uh, I talk about uh, uh, Joe Biden, name, Joe Biden in the United States, uh, which we call Joe Biden. So uh, there are there's some prophecy also, and there are some many, many prophecies that God has spoken out, and by the grace of God, they all came to pass uh, without leaving one behind. Uh, by the grace of God, today now we are going to talk about the prophecy again uh, that uh, Jesus had for us in 2024. Before we speak about that, I want us to read Ezekiel chapter 30, 33, verse 7. Ezekiel chapter 33, verse 7. I will read in English. 
He said, So thou, O sons of man, I have set thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore thou shalt hear the word at my mouth and warn them for me. When I say unto the wicked, O wicked man, thou shalt surely die. If thou do not speak and warn them, if thou do not speak to, to warn the wicked from his way, that wicked man shall die in his iniquity, but his blood will I require at your hands. Now, nevertheless, if thou want the wicked of his way to turn from it, if he do not turn from his way, he shall surely die in his iniquity. But thou hast delivered thy soul from anger of God. Amen. By the special grace of God, I have been compelled to give some special warning for, for the house of God, uh, which is too, too serious at this moment and too powerful at this moment. About some weeks ago, the Lord revealed some things to me. During the uh, trainings, we are holding the three more training. Uh, we are holding school of heaven training. The Lord revealed some revelations of what is going to happen in 2024, and this time around is all going to be serious. As you know, that we are in the end of the world, and uh, a lot of things is surfacing. And the reason why it's surfacing and it's happening is because God is giving us a a kind of intense warning and a serious uh, serious words to tell us that we needed to prepare for what is about to come that the rapture is about to take place in matthew chapter 24 the bible talk about the incident of the latter days and things that is going to happen uh the lord spoke to me he, he spoke there in that uh, 24 for us to know the incident and the occurrence that is going to happen when it's coming is at hand. We have seen a lot of things that is going to happen to the saint by the grace of God. We have seen a lot and uh, they are all coming to pass well, according to how it is written in the book of Daniel and also in Matthew chapter 24 and also in other, other places by the special grace of God. 2024 by the grace of god i want to tell you this 2024 is full of a evil pregnancy and a good pregnancy the bibles have said it earlier that the wicked will wash war stronger in the latter days and the evil will begin to come and before in the latter days Though I am see on it, praying about it, because a lot of evil things that God said is going to happen and the good things, I'm still praying that God, if God in his merciful can avert them, so that they will not uh, come to, to uh, they will not happen or that people will not be affected because God was putting, God opened my eyes to see, God opened my eyes to see what is actually going to to apples god open my eyes uh <clears throat> number one things by the special grace of god that is going to happen in uh, 2024 is uh, actually the is a signal and a sign that is already happening a signal and a sign that's already happening and what is that signal? It's a signal of lack. The Lord told me specifically and boldly, He told me that 2024 will be full of lack. Financial problems, food problems, uh, and other things will be a severe matter 
in 2024. And this flag is not going to be in Africa alone. It's going to run out all over the world. By the grace of God, there are already signs. When God spoke to me, there are signs that he also appeared to me. He told me, that makes me to know that this thing is not going to be just a, it's not going to be a kind of joke. The Lord told me, uh, before he told me the prophecy of 2020, 2024, an angel of the Lord appeared to me. The angel of God appeared to me and told me some revelation. Even warning me, he told me that, my son, do this, do this, do this, or else you will be a victim. He told me, do the dishes. And by the grace of God, I begin to work on that things and begin to do that. Because that, what we're talking about, lack, is going to even fall on those who are working and those who are not working. So the, this one is not a matter of I am working, I am earning money, I have this. This is going to increase in prices. It's going to increase in a very high level prices. Food will be so costly to eat. Life will be miserable for people to live in. In sense of the food will not be able to, you will not be able to, uh, to, to manage it. In buying the, the expensive is going to be too expensive that people will be so worried. Be so worried. What is not going to be anywhere alone. There's no specific place. It's going to be worldwide. 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 It will be in a point. It will get to a point. Food will not be producing again. Yes. There's so much scarcity. People were seriously hungry very very hungry at that moment another one the lord also told me about 2024 prophecy is that he said there is going to be a, a war in a party in one particular famous country there is they are going to throw a bomb on one country i don't know that country now the Lord have not actually tell me, but he said, it should be one famous country. It might be United States of America. It might be on uh, London, England, you know, London. It might be on uh, on uh, China. It might be on Russia. It might be on, I don't know. But he said, a famous country. There is going to be a bomb thrown in suddenly that a lot and thousands of souls will completely perish. Completely perish. That is going to come to pass in 2024. A famous country. I don't know that name of that country. I don't know that name of the country, but it said there is a particular bomb thrown there. They will not be aware that the bomb is coming. It's going to be a normal, normal activities. They will be going on their way, going to their working place, going on the normal, normal, doing their normal, normal jobs. And the bomb will be thrown. Children will pass off. Men will pass off. Women will pass off. Our unbeliever will go with this. Christians will go with this. It's going to be a serious, uh, a serious lamentations on that in that country. I don't know, but he told me a famous country will be will be seriously by fires and uh, they will throw a uh, bomb there. Now in 2024, there is going to be many cops. So I saw in that revelations in my in, in the spirit of the Lord. Uh, I saw in that revelation that there are cops everywhere. When I'm talking about cops, I'm talking about everywhere were full of cops. <laughs> to the level that we just go in on the street, we see a dead person on the ground. What is killing them? God did not show it to me, to me yes. But something is coming in 2024. Please, I beg you in the name of Jesus Christ. I beg you, I beg you, I beg you in the name of Don't talk to this person. It is what I saw and it's so clear to me. It's what is confirmed clear. Don't talk with this person. Don't think that it's a person that I've been getting uh, from one person. And, no, 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 no. If you go through my, you will know that there are prophecy I've written, I've spoken about, and they are by the is coming to pass with that light. Listen to me. I'm not a person that compares or hear because no, 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 no. I hear and I tell. There's no thing, there's no, there's no reason why I should be telling you something and if they are not and uh, in the expense of my heaven. No, 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 no. I'm telling you what is a confirmed revelation of what is going to actually happen in 2024. That's why I said that there is, is, is a year of pregnancy. It has a, a pregnancy to prove. This is going to give back to a lot of things. Yes, a lot of things that you have never heard of. 
Now, 2023, we have passed on, and I told two of us to do the and it has already happened. Aha. I told them a lot of things that I couldn't remember now. Go to the video, you will see them in 23 if you still there now this is 2024 that i'm telling you now now i saw cops everywhere what is happening when i saw the cops wow i saw jawi people jawi jawi people using people anyhow this one is using people i saw people drunk and old dying like chicken i saw another thing there's a thing there's something that the government is involving in that is going to cause a death death there's going to cause death and serious death for people i don't know that thing yet but something that is being said by the government to wipe out the nations by force by fire and that is going to result to death of humanity and this death is going to be thousands of death worldwide 2024 is going to be a year of total, total, uh, let me say, fulfillment of evil plans. It will take only God Almighty to preserve his children from this passing, from, from this thing that is going to happen. Amen. I'm talking about 2024 is going to be a serious dimensional uh, uh, incident. I saw there are people everywhere and i saw but, but part of people who sat i saw part of, part of people who sat everywhere they were part who sat everywhere who sat who sat everywhere i don't know what is going to happen but i saw it i saw people. it will get to a level that we just see somebody strong before you know they already who sat children will die on the road i don't know what is happening i don't know what is going to happen but i saw that one other one i saw there will be a lot of cheating upon people by the light and big men of the world rights will be restricted now i saw another thing like something like a cheating i saw like i saw some big big men maybe i don't know maybe this government or whatsoever people they were cheating people taking away their right, you know, taking what belongs to you and uh, and uh, do something that, I don't know exactly, but that is what the law said. There's going to be a lot of shootings and uh, a kind of uh, right restrictions that will not be able to allow you to, to exercise your human right. They will completely, they'll take it away in this 2024. There will be a rally protest that will cause promotions in 2024. I don't know what I saw people coming together in this country. I don't know. I don't know the particular country. Uh, I don't want to tell you what I didn't wish. You know, that's why I'm telling you the, the real fact. Uh, I saw people coming together and they were pro protesting everywhere, protesting. And the protestations lead to something very bad, lead to something very bad. It's going to be decided like uh, uh, this uh, this protest. What is the name? Uh, uh, the name of this pro protest that uh, the youth did in Nigeria. Essence protest. The way they killed them is going to be like it's either like that or more than that. So I saw people dying. It's going to be lead to promotions of uh, serious killing. And I saw it get to a level that people begin to enter houses and begin to keep with them. I didn't know the particular state or the country, but then I saw that kind of things. So people should pray against it so that uh, the Lord can avert it. There's nothing in God that it, there's nothing so hard for God to, to do, but we needed to pray. Uh, many we suffered in 2024. So who we, uh, okay, yeah. So what he says is this I saw that uh, there are some people that God have really that are really in the high level now. They are rich right now. But in 2024, they will actually go so far. They will become poor. They will become poorer that. It will get to a level that even to be it will be difficult. I saw rich, rich people going poor to the level that they will be tempted to go and do, do this much. This is both Christians and unbelievers. I saw it so clearly that Riches and wealth was taken away from some people 
and they became so poor and so 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 much poor that things was uh, getting more harder and i saw some people too that are in a poor state now god is going to uplift them in the high level by the grace of god and some people need that are uh, being lifted up uh that is on that one uh, i saw human sacrifice of babies i saw baby sacrifice i've told you before that that there are, there are things that is going to happen to babies i don't know in that case we need to look for baby around snatching baby from people and using them for for something else i don't know so i don't know why but i saw children with snatch snatch away and uh, gone forever uh uh and then there's something i also saw the day i saw something like a rain i saw that in a dark cloud on the on the surface of the sky i saw a dark cloud on the surface of the sky so i was asking god what is this it was so heavy it was a kind of it was bubbly bubbly on that time it's like a, a it's like heavy like a thick a thick rain that was angry bubbly it was bubbly so i bubbly 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 so I was like, what is this thing that wanted to happen? And the Lord said to me that, is, uh, that something is about to fall into the world. I don't know, maybe something is going to fall down. I say something is going to fall on somebody. I don't know. The planet is going to, I don't know. But I speak, or maybe it's going to emerge in this world thing. Maybe something even is going to happen in the world. I saw that in Bobby, and it's about to be pushed and it's pushed down to the world. I don't know if something wanted to fall in the world or something even wanted to happen. But that is what I has rather so to it is called for serious prayers because many people will pass off in this thing and the death will be extreme, so extreme. Uh, and uh, the Lord also sent me something as I told you that an angel appeared to me. He appeared to me about a month ago, and the angel told me specifically and periodically, he told me straight away, he said, he said, Peter, go and farm. He gave, you didn't imagine that angel of God just come and tell me to go and farm, and he go back again. He only came and tell me, go and farm. I said, something is about to happen. Say, go and farm. Say, go and farm. So, and this thing give me kind of, uh, when I, I, I wake up from my revelations, I, I was so worried and I began to look at what is going on. So, the Lord told me, to be, he said, go and farm. So, this means that there is going to be a problem about food. I don't know yet now, but there is going to be a problem about food. Everyone, if you are not in Nigeria, tell them to farm. Tell your family to farm so that they will not rely on you. And you that you are anywhere in the world, find a family place and farm if possible for you, so that uh, you can uh, actually uh, save. Uh, then another thing I want to tell you is what one of the things I've been telling you before now. If you are living in the town or city, try to move to the forest. There's something that is going to happen in the town. I've told you many times and can't just not pass. You are looking at uh, something is not happening. You are expecting something like you know to something happens or so. You see, it? when they are talking about this thing, don't joke with it. Don't build your house again in the town. Build them in the forest. Build them there in the outskirts of the in the you know I mean in the in the bush. Don't stay. Even though you are going to come in the town, make sure you are watching. Something is still going to happen. I saw it again myself. Twenty twenty four happening again. I don't know what is going to happen, but I saw something is going to happen again. Then I saw pastor dying. I saw ministers of God dying. I saw pastor dying. And I saw God exposing many pastors. But one of the things I saw is that the more God was exposing them, the more people's eyes was getting open. And I saw people trying to subscribe to holiness. I saw people who are worthy, they are trying to subscribe to holiness. It's like God is opening eyes. God is opening eyes of people. And God is raising soldiers for this end time. God is raising soldiers for this end time. So uh, that is one of the things I uh, I saw. Uh, amen. Uh, one of
not the thing I saw in 2024. Yeah, the Lord told me that He's going to see His people again. There's going to be a, a sheep going on again in this 2023 before the end of this year. The Lord told me that He's going to see His people. I was asking him, I said, but I was told that uh, he has seen his people already about uh, this. He said that that is for 2020. He said he's going to do the 2024 home again. There's going to be a seed going on. He said the seed is going to be the one to protect them for the 2024. He's present or current. Uh, or, or, or current. The seed is going to go around by the angel of God to see. We see a mark on you. You might have a dream and see a mark on you. The Lord said he's going to see them. For the happening of 2024 so please ask god in prayer that god should see me as a signs of protection to to take me away from the incident that is going to occur in 2024 yeah during the years of uh, it's going to happen the city is going to happen occurred in december in december around 30 31 january 1 the city is going to happen at that moment so you have to make sure that you are holy at that time if possible be a fasting and prayers so that uh, you can call and you can align with the, the grace of god therefore be prayerful and be very careful i saw uh there's a popular pastors that is well known in the world he fell into serious sickness and that sickness was severe was severe was severe uh so another one is that uh, I saw that uh, food, food price which seems to be becoming ah uh, uh, okay I saw something like a uh, uh, government trying to lessen the things down, making things better like they are going to be cheap, a little bit cheap you know, but the Lord said it's a lie that is going to be more increased that is just a lie that there is not going to be a solution on the issue of uh, shipping of food or not that it is a it is one of the agendas that these enemy people are doing so as to uh to uh to to launch the plans they have 2024 is going to i saw something like a a, a a sheep being passed on to people, sheep, ships passing on to people for before you can enter a particular country. So the Lord like Jesus made them as an evil spirit will release personality. The spirit is like a black smoke. The spirit is like a black smoke. This spirit will be en the entering people houses, spreading strange name diseases around. This spirit will went abroad and was well established this spirit i saw a black smoke of a spirit the spirit i didn't know the it is just in the form of a black smoke he went around and began to enter people's house and i saw people getting sick and the sickness was resulting to parties death and so on and so forth so as i said before people of god i want to bet in the name of god it is time to find Time to find the Lord bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. By the Spirit, says, Mr. Jesus of God, this is a prophecy that the Lord has shown me for 2024. And by the special grace of God, there is something that is going to also happen. By the grace of God, we are going to have uh, a prayer going on right now. Uh, by the grace of God, we are going to have a program going on right now, and this pro and this uh, program is going to be seven days program, and this is going to happen. Uh, and let me look at the date. The prayer is mainly to avert, is to avert the incident that the devil has actually planned for the year. Uh, for the year uh, 2020, 2020, uh, 2020, uh, 2024, the plan is to avert it. The program is going to start from uh, Tuesday on 26. Tuesday 26. It's going to be in my video. Please, I want to ask you if you are if you are interested 
in the prayer. It's going to be a deliverance prayers and a serious prayers against the incident that is going to happen in the that is going to happen in 2020, 2020, uh, uh, 2020. Uh, four by the grace of God is going to start on 26 and it will end on January uh, 2, January 2 or so, January 1 or January 2, it will end there. It's going to be a serious prayer with fasting and prayer. So, everyone watching this should go and uh, you're going to enter the fasting just in seven days. You can break anytime in the afternoon or in the evening. And you have to come, it's going to be a night VG. And the navy day, I'm going to give you time, timing. So if you want to come into the zoom, I want you to tell me I on WhatsApp. My number will be on the screen there. You can put it there and say, I post you, please. Can you please uh, share me the zoom link? And I will share you the zoom link. And from now, I'm going to start putting the poster right now on the YouTube and the Facebook and the Twitters and the Instagram and everywhere. So if you want to join the program, it's going to be a very powerful deliverance. Number one is going to deal with the problem you passed through in 2023. It must not enter with you in 2024. Number two is going to be the destructions of evil plans that the devil has pregnantly put on 2024 to destroy his entire plans. And then number three is also to bring an open way for you, open door for you. In the year 2024, by the grace of God, uh, the number four is to for the ceiling that God's ceiling. The number five is going to be a deliverance 